Uh, so let's see how to use this laptop mockup template inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So once you download this template, you should get this zip file. Now just unzip it and you will get this folder over here. Now just open up that and you will find these folders inside it. Now this is the mogul folder. If you open up that, you will find 11 different uh, scenes of this mogul files. You have to just install them in Premiere Pro, which I will show you in a moment. But first, before that, if you want to use the same font that uh, I have used, then I will recommend you to copy and paste this font link to your browser, download and install it. Okay, now let's see how to install these mogul files. For that, you have to open up Premiere Pro and then just go to Windows and make sure to select this SHL graphics and make sure you're in this browse tab over here. See this browse tab? Now what you have to do is select all of them over here and drag and drop in this section. Now as you can see, everything will be installed over here. All you have to do is just drag and drop um, the scenes in the timeline over here, something like that. <laughs> as you can see, we just scrub through over here. It will be played. Now if it's a bit laggy, so right click on the on screen over here. Playback resolution, make this one 1 by 4. Also the pause resolution, make it 1 by 4. Just for the uh, editing purpose, but when you render it, it will be absolutely clear. Okay, now let's see how to add the uh, screen, how to change the text, colors, etc. So I'm, I have imported two videos over here. You can in images if you want as well. You can also use a website a screen recording if you want to display your website over here. And then you can select this um, layer and from the edit tab, you will find all of the settings. So at first, you will find some media where you will find the laptop screens over here. Now you can just uh, drag and drop the media over here in this screen. It will be replaced. Now as you can see, it is a video. So it will play the video. But if it's an image, it will be still over here. Then uh, if I just turn off, you can find the text over here. So if I just go to the front, there's a text or laptop mockup. So you can just open up this text parameter and change your text. Like so, you can change the font, other font setting, etc. And then we find these color settings where you can change the text color. Also, you can change the background color. So let's make this something like like so. And if I just scroll through, you can also change the laptop colors. So the laptop color consists with three different tint colors. So you can, if you change the black, it will change the black colors over here. And the gray will change the mid-tone gray color and white will change the highlight color. So you have to choose it over here. So that's basically it. In the same step, you can drag and drop any scenes you like. If I just drag and drop other scenes, let's suppose this one. This one has a text with text box as you can see over here. Full. See? The experience over here. So this text box is auto-resizable. If I just open up this text folder in the text tree. Like I just change the text. As you can see, it auto resize. And if I just drag and drop the end scene, it has a logo. So let me show you. Over here, if you select it, you will have an option for the logo. So import your PNG logo and replace it, it will be replaced. And everything else is same. You can display the original logo color or the manual color if you want.